welcome to a new weekly video. So this week I am back with my little box. I'm really excited. I love the design and theme. I didn't expect this at all. I was actually worried that they would do either a Valentine's Day kind of thing or a romantic thing or I don't know something like sexy. You know, you see all those kind of things around that time of the year. So this kind of pleases me. It brings me back to my French side. Um, whenever I was in school, the February school holidays would be the time where we would go somewhere where there's snow, usually. it's I'm from the south of France, where it's very warm, and some of my family was living in the Alps, so I could go there and do some skiing. So this kind of gets me excited. It's kind of reaching for my French side, but I guess it's made in France, so it's probably where they got the idea from. Most people would go skiing around February time. So, let's go for it. I have not looked at anything, but to me, if I think of the mountains, and if I look at that picture, like the mountains in the winter, I think like a day out skiing, and then some getting inside in the chalet, and getting the fire on, and getting warm and cozy and drinking hot chocolate and having some raclette or fondue or something like that. So I don't know if there's going to be anything of that in there, but we're about to see. So the only thing I've done is um, the, I've just stuck the sticker there and it says all about the après ski. Après ski is, what do you even call that in English? Do you know those big, big boots you put on after skiing when you walk? Oh, but après ski means after skiing as well. All about what you do after skiing then. So is it a box of coziness and warmth and... Anyway, this is what it looks like when you open it. So there's a beautiful illustration. It says, how you climb a mountain is more important than reaching the top. And there's a lady on a... Is that a ski lift? See, I know all these things in French. But... I think, is that a ski lift? I'm sure you understand what I mean if I say ski lift. Okay, yeah, <laughs> get cozy. So, a little book to warm you up. Get cozy by my little box. So let's see what's inside. So this is a little intro. Oh my God. Okay, is the whole box is based on that. Okay, so they refer in the, it is an intro and they refer to a book which I actually have here, which is this book which is a Danish book and it's basically the Danish way to live well and I'm in the middle of reading that book and so far I love it. It's exactly inspiring me. Um, so basically it's um, sipping tea by the fireside in your wooliest pair of socks as you chat away the afternoon with someone you love. It's as much about the physical warmth as the emotional warmth. So this is the whole snuggly sense of well-being thing so first there is if it's a question like a quiz about skiing about ski etiquette then climb every mountains like facts about the highest mountains I'm guessing and or some mountains anyway world's loveliest mountains aha there you go. There you have it. The book. A reference to the book. Um, and then there is... Okay, there is a Thai butternut soup. There is a um, recipe, which is really nice. Oh, and several more recipes. Pumpkin and cashew soup, classic tomato soup, parmesan spinach and artichoke soup. So four soup recipes. That's a really good idea, especially for that time of the year, because it would be nice to have soup. Chunky ski snood a knitting pattern. This is amazing. Oh my god. I love I'm gonna love this box. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna open this because I'm sure for those of you who don't know how to knit or don't like knitting, you won't be happy. But and there's a knitting needle, not a needle, but like a thing you use at the end to tie everything together. So uh, um Okay, so it's from a place called Stitch and Story, which I've never heard of. Uh, if you want, I'm guessing they buy, they sell kits or like knitting kits. Yeah. And you can shop online at stitchandstory.com and there is a code, like a discount code. If 
I can focus on this if you want to have a look and then the website is down there so you can just feel free to use the code if you want to so this is to make a chunky ski snood sorry it's very hard to focus on those there we go and there's the whole pattern oh that's very good you need uh, two uh, t two sets of 100 grams yeah, like wool balls like what you call them some of these two of them knitting needles and the sewing needles that you get already in the kit and then you have um, you have actually have explanations of all the stitches that you will need for the pattern I'm guessing it's a it's a, an easy enough one to make really um, but that's a really good idea something to do while you get cozy I'm definitely giving that a go I haven't knitted this winter yet and I think that's my next project <laughs> I'll keep you updated in the vlogs about this what do we have next oh sticky notes I love stationery in case you didn't know so these are mountain shaped sticky notes which are they're, they're all the same they're just like in a, a kind of ombre pattern ombre blue color that's really nice I love sticky notes I use them all the time so definitely really nice and then oh there's a lot in there okay this is really cute okay it's a tiny tin with the same pattern that's on the box that's so so cute and there's something inside I wonder what it is my little mountains box says on the side <laughs> I love those tins what is this oh it's a brooch okay I'm going to show you this and it's written in French on it I love it I love it it says coeur de glace which means oh god come on camera focus there we go it may, means um, ice of, no, heart of ice, not ice of heart. And it has like a little pin. I might actually put that on my coat. I kind of like it. It's really cool. It's almost like um, one of these fabric patches, you know. But, and a little tin, I'm definitely going to use a little tin. That would be good for like, ta like you want to carry some tablets or, you know, any medicine with you. It's a nice one. I'm gonna leave the little baggie to the end, although I do like the fact that it has, uh, it's themed because there's something that really, <laughs> okay, it says chasse neige on it and chasse neige is, uh, do you know the, um, it's like a big truck that has, at the front it has a thing like this and it pushes the snow off the road, I have no idea what that's called, toe warmers, does that mean socks, does toe warmers mean socks, so we have this, and it says toe warmers, whether you're hitting the slopes or strolling down the high street, this cozy pair of socks will ke help keep those toes nice and toasty when the temperature drops to teeth chattering. Oh, that's the sort of <laughs> Made with love and a little bit of silver thread to help put some sparkle back in your step and glam back in your boots. I love socks. I really, really love socks. Ooh. Ooh. I really like that. They actually match the, the gloves that we have. Ooh, I like that. Look at this. This is sparkly. <laughs> oh my god. Look. The back of the sock. I love little details like that. Well, I should do it like this. Cold feet. Oh, come on. Cold feet. And uh, yes, they are like navy. Um, I'm a size 8. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to try it on top of my current socks. I can't be bothered taking all my socks off. But it's just to give you an idea of the side. Yeah, they are very stretchy. Like, I'm a size 8. These are on top of another sock. They are very stretchy and I love them. I don't like constricting socks. But I still like stuff, socks that stay on. And these seem like they will do the job. But it's almost a shame to hide this. I might just put on my sound. Like... I have like some little Mary Jane thing, so you can see a little bit of the sock. Oh, look at the inside, sparkly! Oh, I love it. I love this box so far. Now the little bag feels very empty, or maybe no, it has three things I think, but they are very small. So we're gonna do like a lucky dip thing. Are you ready? There's a ball. Oh, we had that. Was it in, in the Christmas box? There was a lip thing. That's the My Little Beauty lip balm. So it's white and has little snowflakes. Fresh kiss. Lip balm, my little beauty. Oh, is it tinted? I don't know why we're gonna try it. 
<coughs> excuse me i have nothing on my lips it smells like strawberries i think yeah Or cherry. I don't know. Red food. That's nice. Sorry, I started to sneeze and I have to pause the camera for a minute. Then, okay, there's two more things. Really little small tubes. Oh, a professional. I think I've had one a long time ago in one of the books, but this is a product I really, really like. Um, I don't use it on a daily basis. I only use it when I put a full face of makeup, which doesn't happen that often. But when I do, this is a really nice base. If you're someone who um, likes to wear a full face of makeup every day, this is kind of a, it almost leaves like a silicone film on your skin and it makes it so much nicer to apply foundation on and keeps your foundation on for much longer and it kind of blurs out your pores and all. It's actually really working. I really like this product. It's not something I would like to use on my skin every single day, but um, I know a lot of people who do and I mean, if that's what you're into. I could definitely recommend this product because I have tried it and I really like it. So that's a really nice one. And this, oh, an eye cream. I've been, I've been needing an eye cream for the last two weeks. I've run out of mine. And it's a polar one. I like the polar uh, product. I've, I've only actually ever tried them in the my little, oh, it's a roll-on eye cream. That's a really good idea. I have makeup on there, but I kind of really want to try it. It is um, Instant Eye Contour Energizer with Siberian Ginseng. That's a really good size for an eye cream because I mean I was gonna say it's like really small products but like you would you don't need a lot of eye cream. Oh I can see that it would actually work. And it, it doesn't have a lot of strong scent. You can actually put it on your um, mobile eyelid and under your eye. It stimulates eyelashes growth. That's really good because usually I yeah, like you have to put them like you know around but that's a really good thing and then there's the usual you know like little cards like this so yes this is a really nice box I'm really impressed I'm I really really like it we really do get like they did say they would put one extra product I think in the last one when they removed the my little world magazine but there I mean we had the pen with the tin, the socks, the sticky notes, the pattern, the little book with the recipes, um, well the print, and then three beauty products. So I mean that's really really good value and they're all, I don't think there's anything I don't like in that box, I actually love everything. It's been a long time, I haven't said that, I wasn't like, no I did like the Christmas one, I'm not gonna lie, but you know there's stuff I know I wouldn't necessarily use myself. But this is an amazing box. So my little box, if you are watching this video, well done. Seriously, because it was a good one. Um, let's let's keep it up for the next month. <laughs> um, but yes, I'm I'm definitely going to be looking forward to using all these things. And I think I'm actually going to put those socks on right now. Anyway, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And also hit the little bell button beside the subscribe button. This way you will know whenever I upload new videos. But in case you want to know, I upload new videos at 5 p.m. on Mondays, Wednesdays, Thursdays and Fridays. Three of those videos are vlogs, are family vlogs, and one is an extra video like this one, which is like a lifestyle video, so it can be my favorite of the month. Uh, product reviews, um, little box reviews, and anything I feel like doing. <laughs> um, if you haven't seen last week's one, I did a video with my son Owen. I translated a tag that was French, and it's called... Uh, what does my son think about me or something along those lines it's already on the channel if you want to have a look at it and yes uh, i hope you have a lovely week and i'll see you next week for another video bye